So before I start Wild Women Wet Shaving, I go to the Craig Street Market here in Parksville every single week like clockwork. And I ran into the cutest, cutest kid. I can't remember his name, but he works for Seabreeze Soap Company. The funniest moment. I was standing on this side looking at all the different body soaps and everything and I was like what's your favorite one and he was like the vanilla mint soap and I had picked one out before I had asked him and it was the vanilla mint soap I it was it was an awesome moment so I had to support and I had to buy it smells really really nice and I'm really excited to use it so thank you again um, Seabreeze soap company I'm really really excited to try your soap it's Thursday and welcome back to another episode of wild women wet shaving I wish I could tell you how many episodes this is but truth be told I don't really keep track so if you know leave it in the comment section below because I really want to know how many episodes are at <laughs> of Wild Lizzo Wet Shaving. <laughs> I shaved yesterday on the beach when it was so incredibly foggy and then I woke up this morning, I walked outside and I was like, oh, I can actually breathe. And being able to breathe from my little tiny lungs over the past week was excruciating. So welcome back, blue skies, you have been missed. Okay, so, Barrister and Man Lavender Shaving Soap. There are not enough gold stars in the world to present to this shave soap company. I love, love Barrister and Man shaving soap. The fragrance is really nice. The lather is really, 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 really easy to pick up. Uh, it is a thirstier soap. So do be mindful that you do need more water than you think you do. So really, really, really lather up on this shave soap. And plus there's a ton in here, so you won't run out anytime soon. So for the shaving brush, I used my Chubby 3. I love this shaving brush. He's kind of 
kind of a dork. When he lathers, it's it's a lot of shaving soap for what you really need. And I tend to find that over exacerbates. Is that a word? Anyway, there is way more shaving soap on this shave brush than anybody really needs. But I have more shaving soap than anybody really needs. So I feel like it's a good trade-off. Razor blades, Parker. Um, milder than I expected, but not as mild as you think. Um, if you know Astra Platinums at all, those have a very similar feel to these Parker razor blades. I really, really enjoyed them. Shaver. Oh, blade's still in the shaver. Oh, and Sandy. Apologies, the equipment isn't clean. <laughs> um... Look at this. It's a mammoth. I think they call it the Goliath. I don't, I can't remember. But look at the size of this razor. Okay, so my palm. Anyway, I really, really like this razor. The only problem that I'm finding, that I'm having with this razor, is because there's so much weight behind it it's kind of easy to just throw yourself into shaving with it. So you kind of just kind of hack away a little bit more than if you were using something that you're a little bit more intimidated by. Either I would say like the Rockwell or a slant bar. I tend to shave more tentatively. But with this razor, I don't know. We still have to work a little bit on the finesse of the West Coast. <laughs> Aftershave balm, lather bros. This aftershave balm has saved me from many a terrible shaves. It's really, really nice. It's super soothing. Smells good. And I find the fragrance lingers just long enough for you to enjoy it, but it's not overly so where you're still smelling it 18 hours later and it gets that sweet scent. There are some aftershave bombs that do that and it's incredibly annoying, but this one doesn't. <laughs> so yeah, please do not forget to like this video. There's a little thumbs up somewhere. I haven't yet discovered which side of the page that it sits on, but it's there. There's a subscribe button and a little bell beside that button. If you want to see and get notified the minute a video is posted, whether it's here on Wild Women Wet Shaving or any of my other channels, you can see it there. And, you know, I do other stuff that's also kind of fun. Uh, and don't forget to comment in the comment section below. I I love reading your comments. It brightens my day. It brightens my week. It helps me to remember that um, I need to source new product to keep you interested. It reminds me that I need to post a new video. So please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you beautiful people next Thursday. Bye. see me do like have my coffee set my stuff ah. <laughs>